special tribute to music legend Billy Joel. His hometown of Oyster Bay honored him with a street renaming ceremony and also a key to the town. CBS 2's Natalie Dudridge spoke to the man, also known as Mr. Long Island. My mom would have been thrilled. I wish she could see it. The piano man got a grand honor Thursday morning. A section of Audrey Avenue in the town of Oyster Bay is now known as Billy Joel Way. To the delight of fans, I will be so happy walking down Billy Joel Way. I have my own street sign. William Martin Joel was born in the Bronx, but spent his childhood in Oyster Bay, where he has since owned multiple homes. He says when the New York State Legislature approached him about the street renaming, at first he was hesitant. You want to rename the street after you? And I said, Yeah, but don't you have to die first? <laughs> And then they came back with the answer, yes. <laughs> and I said, honestly, I'd, I'd rather still be alive and not have the street. <laughs> but now I'm, I've got the best of both worlds. Billy Joel's not only a multi-platinum selling artist, he's a committed philanthropist. Thursday, he was also honored for his contributions with a key to the city. And it was the performance of a lifetime for these six graders from the James H. Vernon Band who got to play and sing for him. It's definitely shocking and I'm speechless. It's something that they're going to remember for the rest of their lives. And fans have something else to look forward to. Billy Joel's other home, Madison Square Garden, announced in honor of his 75th birthday. They're adding a special show on May 9th and the tickets for that event go on sale at the end of October. In Oyster Bay, Long Island, Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News. Totally deserved. Yeah, and I love the way he shows up like he's just, you know, a local guy, which he is, which he totally but you know, is. he just blends right in. Right? And love he's that. alive, too. That's the best part. <laughs> Thank goodness. Yep.